certificates basic of digital certificate a digital certificate is elect equal equivalent of the electronic passport okay digital certificate enable user host organization to exchange information securely over the internet because we want to identify the user we want to authentic authenticate the user okay in order to authenticate we need a digital certificate because that is uh, it, it, is, it is more secure and also is more scalable. The digital certificate, authenticate, that's the same kind of certificate which you will receive after the degree. Authenticate and verify that the user sending a message are who they claim to be. So when you connect with the, previously we shown you, for example, when you um, connect with the, I believe, um, Google website, Okay, so this is the, if you look at the certificate, it is validating that I am definitely connected to the Google. This certificate is intended to the following purpose, ensure, ensure the identity to the remote computer. So it verify the identity of the system. Okay. And it is given by the Google Trusted Services Global Sign Root CA. Okay, that's a view certificate in detail global sign so it's a third party which verify the identity and all the information of the uh, google how can i trust the google i don't trust maybe directly to the google but third party my browser and i i trust that third party and they requested their identification in order to get this certificate of course there is a complete process criteria okay so you can see this is I, I shown you already in a minute I will show you further information how we can create a digital certificate what the digital certificate could have it has the new version number serial number certificate algorithm issuer name validity period so it has the validity as well let similar like your CCNA has a validity of two years probably three years, three years. so subject key user uh, ident uh, unique identification subject in, uh, unique identification extension ca version number so you can see it start from here serial number secure algorithm you see sha okay guys anybody knows about sha is it provide the is does it provide authenticity does it provide integrity does it provide the encryption integrity, integrity. thank you very much issuer Google Trusted Services and valid from 12 February 2020 and to public key, private key. So you see this is 256. Similarly, if you go to, for example, HSBC website and you see their certificate that may be issued by the digi, digi sure. cert okay issue a statement detail again this is Shah so that is verified that I am connecting to the right person so you see this this private key Look at this private key, a uh, public key, 2048-bit, very long. As for Google, what about the Google certificate? Is it 256? Yeah, 256. Yeah. You see? Because, the other thing is because it's a financial industry, so Google is just like normal. But I think if you go to the uh, Amazon, for example, it maybe has the... Yeah. Yeah. Yes, usually wherever the financial transactions are, it's it's more secure. A digital certificate must follow a standard structure so that it an entity can read and understand it regardless of the issue. And X.25, X, sorry, not 25, X.59 is a standard for construction of digital certificate and a public key infrastructure used to manage digital certificate. PKI is the policy, rules, procedure to create, manage, distribute, 
use, store, and revoke the digital currency. So PKI, some job maybe you see there are requirements for PKI infrastructure understanding, which which is a procedure define the policy role, procedure create, manage, distribute. So it creates the certificate, it manages the certificate, and it's distributed all over the world. Use, store, and revoke the digital certificate if it's not valid. Okay.